Welcome back to our YouTube channel SK Educates. Today we will learn migrating a website from one host to another in an easy way. In this live example, I will be transferring my website from Himalayan host, my existing host, to the new host which is Hostinger. You can also use free WordPress plugins like Opdraft Plus and all-in-one WP migration to migrate your WordPress website from one host to another host easily. However, when you are transferring big file sizes like 5GB, 10GB, then you will run into various issues. And it may also put load on the new host. So the process we learn today will let you migrate your website, may it be WordPress or any other website from one host to another in four easy steps. Step 1 includes downloading your files and databases from the existing host. In step 2, we will set up new hosting plan on Hostinger. The third step will be transferring files and database to the new host. And in the last step, we will change the domain name servers to the new host. So without any delay, let's begin. First of all, log in to the existing host and access the cPanel section. Once you are there, you can find file manager where all your website files are stored. Now you need to select all the files and folders inside public underscore html and then compress them to create a single zip file. Remember if your website files are too large it may take some time so be patient. Once the files are compressed you can download it in your computer. Here in my case the file size is 1.1 GB so it is downloaded quickly. Now it is time to download database file. If you are confused which database to download, just access the WP config file in the file manager and search for the database name. Here you can see the database of my website is sunfect wp854 and as you find your database name you can access the PHP My Admin section on the cPanel. The list of database file will be shown here. You can click your database file and then simply export it by clicking the export and go button. With this, step 1 is completed and you have two files downloaded. That is website file as a single zip file and the database file as .sql extension. In step 2, we will set up hosting on new host. For me, it is Hostinger. By the way, Hostinger is one of the best web hosting companies that offers amazing performance at a reasonable price. You can join now and enjoy up to 75% discount on hosting with free domain and lots of premium features. If you purchase hosting plan with Hostinger using my referral link, you get 20% additional discount. So, grab the deal now. I have been using Hostinger since 2 years and till now I am totally satisfied with it. You can read my full review from the link in the description below. Log in to the new host and add your website by selecting create an empty website. Then you need to select existing domain and insert it in the domain box. The new host will ask you to change name servers. However, I suggest you to change it at the last stage so that the downtime of your website will be highly reduced. Now your new hosting setup process is completed and with that you can now set up database, add files or change various settings. As you are in the website management section in the Hostinger as panel, you can create new database by accessing MySQL. Here you need to create new database, its user and password. Insert all details here and keep it safe as you require it later. In this way, the step 2 completes by adding your domain on new host and setting up new database. The step 3 requires transferring database and files we downloaded earlier. First, we will import our database. Access PSP My Admin section of the new host and select the new database we created in the second step. Here you will import the database of your website. Just access import and select the database you downloaded. Click go without changing anything. 
after some time the database will be imported successfully once database is successfully imported you can now transfer website files for that you need to access file manager on your new host and upload the zip file you downloaded and again it will take time if you have if your file size is heavy after the zip file is uploaded completely you can extract files by using on archive option hostinger features its own panel known as s panel if you are using other host you may find c panel but the process is same after the zip file is fully extracted you can delete it now it is time to set up database to the new host for that access the wp config file and find the database section here you have to change the database name user and password that we created in step 2 replace all information and click save once it is done we are ready for the final step which is to change the domain name servers the domain name servers can be found on the host where you have purchased your domain in my case my domain is with himalayan host so i will access the domain here and change the name servers to hostinger you can find the name servers in the website management section hostinger requires me to change my domain name servers to ns1 and ns2 domain as you can see in this video here i will change it and save it it may take up to 24 hours for complete domain name propagation but don't worry it happens quick in most of the time with these four easy steps we have successfully migrated our website to new hosting without any issue if your file size is too large for example 5 gb 10 gb you can transfer easily with this process and if you have any questions please you can ask us in the comment section or we can email us Thank you for watching the video till the end.